Hello YouTube, Facebook and Twitter, it's John, back again with another food review. Today I am at Taco Bell, as you can see with this big box, to try out their new Double Chalupa. Now, they, you can order this in regular or spicy. I got the spicy version. Open it up and see what's inside. Remove the receipt and the napkins. The big box is $5. It comes with the double chalupa. A regular crunchy taco. And a Doritos Locos taco. As well as a beverage. Um... <clears throat> Some online the Taco Bell has this new breakfast salsa stuff, but all all the Taco Bells that I've gone to have no idea what I'm talking about when I ask them if they have breakfast salsa. So still may able to try that. <clears throat> I'm not too disappointed because I hear it's just like an extra mild version of mild. But anyway, let's go into what we came here to see. The Devil Chalupa. So here it is. All wrapped up. Let's see what it looks like when we unwrap it. There you go. It's got tomatoes. It's got lettuce. It's got a nacho cheese and a shredded cheese and sour cream and the seasoned beef. The spicy version. They add jalapenos to it. I don't know if you can see the jalapenos in there. There's one right there. So, it's spicy because it has jalapenos in it. Let's see what it tastes like. So what makes a chalupa a chalupa? I think it's just the shell. It's kind of like a, a thicker shell. Um, yeah, that's, I think that's the difference between a taco and chalupa. It's really like wet and falling apart in my hands, so I'm going to take a bite real quick before it disintegrates. Here's what it looks like on the inside. Close up. As the jalapenos all fell for, towards you. Got some tomatoes on the camera now. But anyway, that's what it looks like on the inside. Like I said, the shell soaked up a lot of that moisture. I don't know if it's from the beef or the sour cream, but like in my hand, I can feel it losing its integrity. So what do I think about the double chalupa? I haven't had a regular chalupa in years, so I don't know what they doubled. The shell looks bigger than I remember. Um, I assume they gave you a double portion of the meat. Uh, that's usually what they mean when they double things. It's just they give you a, a second portion of meat. So, it's a bigger chalupa, I guess. And uh, the jalapenos on it really didn't make it too much more spicy. Um, I ate a couple in there. Their, their jalapenos were really like that. Aren't that spicy? They're more of a, the pickled jalapeno variety. It tastes good. It tastes like any of their tacos, I guess. Um, is this something you necessarily need to go out and try? Is it all that special? No. It's just a chalupa with more stuff in it. And you can get it in the convenient $5 box. 
which I always like because I don't know. I think I'm just drawn to even numbers like five. So I don't know if five is an odd number. But what I mean is five zero zero. There's no ninety nine, and you you can have a five dollar bill. Even though I know after tax it's not five dollars, but seeing it in the menu just makes you kind of happy to see it. Maybe it's an OCD type of thing. I don't know. But I'm going to give the Taco Bell's Double Chalupa a 7.5 out of 10. It's alright. It's good. Would I go out of my way to get it? No. Is it something I would suggest that anyone, anyone needed to necessarily rush out and get? No. But it's a nice thing. It's a decent size. And it's a good $5 meal. But uh, other than that, guys, hope you enjoyed this video with the double chalupa from Taco Bell. Um, I have one shout out, kind of a suggestion. Um, I have a friend, his name is Jeff. He lives in Florida currently and he's doing a sports podcast. I believe he calls his podcast The Hawk. But I'm going to leave a, a link in the description. So uh, if you enjoy sports related podcasts, go ahead and give him a, a look-see. Um, he talks about sports, um, anything from the major professional sports, baseball, basketball, hockey, um, all the way to uh, more entertainment sports like wrestling. In fact, I know for the fact he's a really big uh, WWE uh, fan. So go ahead and check that link out. See what you uh, see what you think about that, and until next time, guys. Bye.